Hello there and welcome to the new Power BI tutorial video and in this tutorial video I will show you the use of if function. First we will look at a simple if function and then a nested if function. So both I will going to cover in this video and uh, if function if you have done uh, some of the work in Excel or in any programming language then you may have seen it that how to use if function. It's pretty similar over here. I just wanted to show you about the syntax with a use case. So our use case is, for example, we have this sale, let's say median X sale, where you have the low sales, which is let's say less than 1000. You have high sales, which is greater than 10,000. So first we will going to do that. Okay. And uh, for this, first I will going to select a table, create a new measure. And I will say simply high and low, high, low sales. So for now, I will say any any sale which is greater than 1000 is uh, high, less than 1000 is low. So median X, let's take just the median X sales is greater than 1000. Simply in double quotation, say high, otherwise low. <coughs> and that's it. That's what you need. Very simple, right? Very similar to what you may have seen in Excel as well. So if you add, what you see is anything which is less than 1000 is low. Anything which is greater than 1000 is high. So everything. Now we will specifically call out this one as high. Anything which is between 1000 and 10,000 is low. Oh, sorry, medium. And anything which is less than 1000 is low. So for that, we will just change this from this to 10,000 high. And then if median X sales is less than 1,000, then low. Otherwise, uh, medium, then let's call it medium. That's a word I can think about it for now. <clears throat> okay, so that's what we need and uh, this is your nested if and if once I do that you will see that for values which is less than 1000 low values which is 1000 to 10,000 is medium and anything which is more than 10,000 is high. So this way you can going you can create a category of values a new category altogether and uh, get the output as per your needs. So that's mainly I wanted to show you the use of a simple if and uh, nested if in this quick video. I hope you have found it useful. Now I'll meet you in the next video with a new topic.